Hi, I'm Karen. Welcome to the Seasons of Living. Today we're going to start our Milk Cow 101 series. And the first thing we're going to do is introduce our dairy heifer, Clove. She is two years old and she's due to calve in April. Now you have your dairy heifer cow. The first thing you need to do is halter break her. We're going to show you the differences between two calf halters. Notice, notice this halter has the nose hole here. It has a, the slip ring here that tightens up on the nose. And then the belt here that goes over the back of the head behind the ears tightens it up and all of this sucks everything up tight. This is what I call a nylon turnout halter. This other halter here this is our leather show halter. Of course this is adjustable in the back for the size of calf you have. It's got the the thin hard uh, leather strap across the nose. It's got the chain under the jaw. This this pulls this pulls and tightens on her nose and jaw. Really handy in making them know how to lead when you do it correctly. You always start with the nylon halter first when they're very young. Then you graduate to this. Then you can graduate to anything. Standard, cheap, rope halter, whatever. We're gonna catch Clove, our dairy heifer, with this and demonstrate how I put this on. If she'll let us. Try to make her think she's caught with that. We just put that through her nose, over her neck, just draw it up snug, make sure it's buckled back through, check it out, make sure it's up on the top of her nose, it doesn't come down over her nose and try to smother her. But I wouldn't leave, I personally don't like leaving them on very long, unless they're supervised. We're going to catch Clove with our leather show halter now. Notice I've already have this thing adjusted for her with a, with a latch on both sides, center it up. So all I have to do is just, is just horse catcher with the belt. Come here. Behave yourself. Catch her with a belt. Get a little slack in the chain. Slip it up over her ears. It'll, it'll go up real easy and then tighten, snug it up the chain underneath and she's ready to go. They make this in several styles. This is our, this is the first halter that we normally try to use on our heifer, our nylon turnout halter. It's very strong. You don't have to worry about it breaking and we use this when we just start them out at three to four weeks. Normally, it's a whole lot easier then, but now it's the same way. So we use this halter to uh, just try to make them go and to tie them up. Make them stand. We normally tie it to where it's a nice, it's an easy slip. Take it off with one pull, 
Do not leave your heifer unattended. Another good idea is to get her desensitized to human touch while she's while she can't go anywhere. Just start rubbing all over her, scratch her ears, get her used to the human touch where she doesn't scare. Try to back off. Just rub all over, down her back, under her chest, neck. Get on back behind, under her legs. Get her used to it. She's going to be fidgeting around like she's doing right now at first. We're just starting her out. That's why we're showing this to you because we're, we haven't been doing this very much. Get your hands back under. See, she's only got four more months to go before she has a calf. If you work with these cows long enough with this halter on, they'll eventually, Can you hear they'll eventually just follow you along hardly any pressure without anything. They will eventually just stop and start. When you walk, they'll stop and start whenever you are. No problem. I've had good luck. Today, Mr. Roofer showed us three things that would help us halter break our dairy cow or heifer. The first one is he showed us two different halters to use. One is a turnout halter and one is a show halter that, that, that uses pressure and release. Secondly, how to tie up our dairy heifer or cow. And thirdly, how important it is to desensitize our cow to human touch. Thank you so much for joining us today at the Seasons of Living. If you are interested in a simple, organic, old-fashioned lifestyle, please subscribe. And remember, if we can do this, so can you. Have a blessed day and bye-bye.